Yep, GG. Alright, time to go to Gwent, guys. <laughs> I'm gonna go to Gwent, and I'll see you guys there. Boom, boom, boom. Watch closely. These people always taunt me because my name's Gwent Academy. <laughs> then they lose. There's no way to get rid of it. Or move it, even. I can't see what he's saying to me. He's saying stuff, and I don't even... Can't even tell what it is. All right, first guy taunted us like crazy. We got him. <laughs> it's always good. Just played against me last game. Oh, if it really was you, I couldn't see what you were saying. I thought you were taunting me the whole game, Iron. <laughs> I sit there. I was like, why is this guy taunting me? I got this stupid thing in my way, so I can't see what you're saying. I honestly thought you were just taunting me the whole game. Because a lot of people do, since I have my name as Quinn Academy. Oh yeah, we got a new quest. I gotta actually see if I can refresh anything. Swap this. Ah, win three matches at Scully Toll. That works. It's the only faction we have decks for right now. Okay, please. Please. Just don't grab me, Polly. It's a one in four chance. Every time! Every time! Uh, probably messed up my hair with that. <laughs> kind of stuff just ticks me off though. Oh man. I'm gonna keep Polly in my hand. Cause then, yeah, he can't grab me Polly. There we go, our problems are solved. Yeah, that's a weak play. We're looking all right now. Yeah, he's definitely going to play Sentry next. Every time, if Polly's not in my hand, I'm done playing Barclay. Or I'm just going to take Polly out. Uh, shoop, let's go. Four power shoop. Give me charm and enemy. Never lucky. <laughs> oh, that's horrible. All these choices are horrible. That's 14 power right there. I gotta draw a card that's worth 10 or 10 more power. Okay. There we go, we're okay. <laughs> Just the charm of random enemy when they start with a big unit like that is always so good. 21 points is a lot on a gold. I mean, it's not like car her into... <laughs> Why did I speak that word? You know who that's going to summon when you say car her. It's going to summon alchemy. You're going to hate your life. Throw Torval back. Probably not even gonna need to drop Torval this round. Wow, that was quick. Did you see how quick that medic grabbed that emissary? That was absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> was that the only. Yeah, no, he could have grabbed an agitator. That was crazy. Then we got Shoop. I think we win. <laughs> I think we're fine. Oh, wait. What do you think about those two... The two rows in the future? I don't know. I can't... Like, me... When I... I like card games. So, like... I didn't start playing this game because I was a big fan of The Witcher. Which I still haven't beat. Or The Witcher's going. So, I mean, it might end up being really good. It depends on what they do with it. Even if that's a Vincent, we're fine. I don't know. They haven't released, like, enough info on it yet. They just said, oh, there's going to be two rows. Um, some cards might change factions. The board's going to get a UI overhaul, and there's going to be like an anima animated board and stuff. That sounds pretty cool. But then they're not going to add in resource costs or like attacking your opponent's face and stuff. So it sounds like it's going to be the same Gwent, but with two rows. And somehow that's going to help them fix the coin flip issue. And they have a coin flip issue fix. Maybe they're going to take out. 
I mean, if they keep Agni and stuff the same, things like Dalbleth on a bomber and last rate would probably be meta. If they are kept the same, because, I mean, you're forced to play on two rows instead. And, like, what are they going to do about White Frost? Because White Frost is basically the Golden Weathers now. They're probably going to have to change the Golden Weathers. I have no clue what this is. What are you? What are you? He has Reveal, some Alchemy cards, <laughs> Vic Cavaro Novice, Royal Decree, or what, Lethal Regis? Okay. So we just scorch that because, yeah, he wants to Lethal Regis us. Drop your one power Regis. <laughs> uh, nope. This is the weirdest game against Reveal I've played. <laughs> Another assassin, okay. No one's really getting anywhere. This is two heavy removals. I screwed up because I didn't grab my Elzer's Thunder. Oh, and is Vincent's done for? And yep, that's he knew it. He knew it. I that's exactly what happens to me when I play anything like that. I play I play Barclay. It's gonna grab me Polly. I play Prince Dennis in an armor deck. He's gonna grab me Vincent. And every that was that's exactly. You have my luck, man. That's how it goes. That's how Gwent is played. RNG never works. <laughs> uh, feels good to see it happen to my enemy for once, though. Alright. So, we shoot for an 8 power one. Get the replay. And move one of these units out of there. Nope. <laughs> uh, that just helps us left the Regis. We have no bronze or silver units left, so we just do 15 damage. Alright, so how much is that? That's too much. 24, 50, 48 or something, yeah. We didn't get the replay to move it and stop it. That's 50. 48. Yeah, any replay cards isn't that great. Come on, Choop, work. Work. Shoop! Shoop! You suck, Shoop. Yeah, that's that's game. Polly was my last one. Seventy? Yeah, two power is not enough. Man, I think we can beat Great Swords though. As long as we don't end up with all our dwarfs in our hand, round two. That was really unlucky, Mulligan. <laughs> 